everyone. Thanks so much for joining me here on Denise Makeup. I know the setting's a little different. Um, here in Vegas right now, it's about 88 degrees, so it's really beautiful outside. The sun went down, and um, I'm just enjoying the outdoors today. I went out for a walk. Um, just beautiful weather. Once the sun goes down, it's beautiful at night. The sun, as you can see, went down, so there's not great lighting, but I decided to do a quick review out here since the weather's so beautiful. I was running around trying to get things done before light completely went out. So I wanted to just do a quick review on some of the things that I've been um, using lately. So a little bit of everything. It's not gonna focus on one particular product. A couple of things that I wanted to show you that I got from Sephora. The first one being for my hair. Y'all know that I really, really like taking care of my hair and I love using different treatments and finding out which one's the best. Uh, for my hair type. My hair, I don't dye it, I don't bleach it, I don't use any kind of chemicals on my hair and I rarely ever do my hair. So usually when I'm not going to go out or do anything in particular, I don't wear any makeup, I don't do my hair, I try to um, keep the hot tools to a minimum. When I do feel that my hair is getting a little dehydrated and it needs a little help, lately I've been using this hair mask. It's called she Butter Body, and it's from Furkai. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it properly, but this is what it looks like. I got it from um, Sephora. It was $65, and it gives you six ounces in this, but you really don't need that much. I've used it about four times, and I barely have used any of it, only because you apply it when your hair is damp. So um, apply a small portion, maybe like a quarter size, and put it on your hair especially on your ends and then what I do is I leave it on till the next day and um, it pretty much doesn't leave it extremely oily but it's really really nice and the next day when you wash it you're gonna notice really nice volume I know that the price is a little steep for a hair mask I've also been using the miracle 10 minute one that you spray on it works good just not as good as this one the the miracle 10 minute um, spray conditioner um, is uh, is good and it's very reasonable it the little bottle cost me I think like $20 so this one's 65 and and I rarely use it um, and when I do it really repairs my hair you can go to Sephora and ask them for a sample before I purchased it I got a couple of samples to try it out because I didn't want to go and spend $65 if it wasn't gonna be such a great product so ask them for a sample and if you feel that it's worth the $65 for your hair then go and and get it um, I just desperately needed something to hydrate my hair since Vegas is super dry goodness and then the second thing that I got from Sephora is their new palette um, they got this one in about a month or two ago so um, I decided to get it only because we're always trying to find you know reasonable ways to uh, do our makeup and to always you know keep up with the trends and with what's new all right, so this is pretty much the Sephora palette. It comes in this little case right here, and it's really, really pretty. Um, this is pretty much how it looks, very shimmery, very sleek black case. You have tons of uh, different lip colors right up here, and then you have a whole bunch of different shades of blushes. So it varies anywhere from neutrals, golds, pinks, very neutral, and then a darker color. You can always mix them to create the color that you want. The neat thing about this is it does come with a mirror. Um, there's five different palettes that you can choose from. And you're like, what are you talking about? It's one full palette. But see in the back of this little baby here, it has little um, spots where you can push them out and it becomes one palette. So you push it out and you can grab the palette that you're using for the day, okay? And then this comes with a portable empty palette where you can use the palette that you're going to be using for the day open it up and then place the palette that you'll be using for the day so and then there's also a mirror right there so it's really nice there you go you take it in your purse and you can always touch up whether it be you know your lipstick blush or whatnot they vary anywhere from neutrals to darker colors to brighter colors um the color payoff for these colors is really great um, according to a Sephora representative or makeup artist, um, they said that uh, Kat Von D uses the same kind of eyeshadows. It's just her name on the product. So I don't know how true that is, but as far as the quality of these and the uh, Kat Von D um, 
shadows that I have or the palettes that I have from her are pretty much very similar. So it does give me a question there, like maybe she is right. Maybe that is the same, you know, um, eyeshadows just with her name on them. So um, I'll kind of show you some of the colors. As far as the glittery ones, which are my favorite, um, there isn't a lot of glitter payoff unless you really get in there and pack it on. So this is a black with the glitter. As you can see, it did grab some, but if you blend too much, that glitter will come off. As you can see, there's hardly any more glitter. Maybe about five glitters in there out of like 20 that it should have grabbed. Goodness, now I have black eyeshadow on my hand, all dirty. Look at me. Um, okay, so then that was a great um, color payoff. Just the glitter, you can't really blend it because then it'll go away. Um, so the colors are gorgeous. I really love this palette in particular because I really love the blacks and grays. I really like that really deep silver color. I think it's perfect to create a smoky eye with. Very, very nice color. Um, and then also the neutrals are also really nice. Um, like I said, there is a great color payoff on these. And I'll just swatch one out right there. See? So it's really, really nice. And yes, I will be doing a tutorial using these. Um, the colors, as far as the lip colors go, they're also very nice. As you can see, I already messed with some of them <laughs> because they're really, really pretty. And I'll try to put one on me right now. What am I wearing? Okay, neutrals. So I think I'm going to go with this nice gold color here. And I'll show you on just a second which one I put on. They're very sheer. They're not like, wow, that's a red color. I'm never going to wear it. It actually goes on more like a pink. So as you can see, it's just a very sheer color, and I applied this one right here. It looks almost like a brown on the camera. That's pretty much it for the Sephora products. This palette's only $29.50. I think it's a great bargain. Um, the quality is great. I would definitely recommend it, and I would buy it for a friend or my sister or my mom, um, although they probably wouldn't use all the colors and appreciate them as much as I would. That is a great, a great gift and a great bargain to buy for yourself. Now that's pretty much it for the Sephora products. Then, I also uh, received some stuff from Posh Population, so thank you Posh Population for sending some of the stuff I really like. Um, some of the things are this beautiful ring. So I'm going to show you all this one because it's my absolutely favorite item that they sent. Um, I love jewelry, and this is pretty much the ring that they sent. So it has like a pink stone right in the center. It has a ladybug, which is like my favorite thing ever. I love ladybugs. And then it has tons of flowers all around it. I swear, I have never seen fashion jewelry with so much detail. And all of their products are very reasonable. I don't have the prices right on top of my head right now. But um, I will put links so that y'all know how much everything is. I know that everything in their site is very reasonable. So I don't think it's going to be an arm and a leg. Um, but it's really, really pretty. I really like the stone there. It has a lot of detail. Um, it's very sturdy. It's not something that's flimsy. It's definitely very heavy. And then I also received this necklace. Now, this necklace comes with rings as well. Earrings, I'm sorry. <laughs> it comes with earrings. And it's really, really pretty. Um, nice detailed flowers with some Saworskis in them. Uh, look at this flower right here. Isn't that gorgeous? It's absolutely beautiful. So it's really pretty. And then it also has pearls. Green flower right here. And then I also received some sandals that are awesome. They're so comfy. I tried them on and I was like, wow, they're so cushiony. Um, they have some stones in them. I thought that was really cute and really glitzy. So um, I really like it. It's really, really, really soft. Again, it's very reasonable stuff, um, and it's really cute. So thank you so much, Posh Population, for sending that. And then I also received a purse, although I haven't used it yet. Um, it's very big. Um, it's, it's very, very pretty, and it has tons of space. So as you can see in there, it has tons of zippers inside. It's just really big, and it's nice for those of you that like to carry tons of stuff. And it also has a zipper on the outside of the bag. And then the inside material has flowers. So it's really cute. And, um, and I've also been taking some oolong tea from Tivana. Some people call it woolong. Some people call it oolong. Just depends um, what you prefer to call it. But I'm, call I'm using, well I'm taking, I'm drinking, Raspberry Rye Lemon Mat, Golden Monkey, and Monkey Picked Oolong. 
so these are this is a blend that I've been taking and it's really helped me as well as far as like energy my caffeine intake I used to take a lot of coffee like I used to drink it every single day I'd have like three shots in my coffee at Starbucks it was a really bad habit I had and it was really hard for me to get out of it so I really had to focus and um, it's been a month without one cup of coffee not even black no sugar no nothing um, all I've been taking is my tea and I actually got really surprised about that because um, I have I haven't needed the energy that the coffee used to give me although it was nice it hasn't been exactly missed. <laughs> I do crave it sometimes, but the Wulong tea has really, really, really helped me. It gives me all of the energy that I need and more. So I'm really happy. The caffeine in my tea is the Raspberry Riot Lemon Mat. That one uh, pretty much substitutes the coffee. The Monkey Picked Oolong has a little bit of caffeine, but not a lot. Um, I was, you know, ignorant to all of the great things that teas offer, and um, I went to Tivana one day, and I'm like, oh, I can't do tea, I can't do it, it's too much, I can't, you know, and then I started drinking it, and I just started craving it, I couldn't believe it, I actually started craving my tea, and I would take it every day, and then it gave me the strength to work out. So, I really don't like going to the gym and doing all these weights and all these things that just promote me to just give up so what I started doing is belly dancing and um, that really helped me I do it five days a week and it's really helped me I've lost two inches from my waist um, it's just it's just amazing I, I really do love it and then after the belly dancing I do weights every other day and abs as well so all of those things put together in one month have completely changed changed my habits and my lifestyle and everything else in general. Um, I, I feel great and that's why I haven't really been making a lot of videos just because I wanted to be completely focused. I've been snacking a lot throughout the day, apples, oranges, you know, peaches, mangoes, all that kind of stuff, maybe about um, five times a day just so I don't get hungry and I keep my energy levels up. So it's been great and I encourage any of you all that want to lose weight to do it as well. 10 pounds, I'm so happy and um, it feels like a great accomplishment for me. So I really thank you all for the nice comments that you've been leaving me for checking up on me. Uh, my allergies are crazy right now so if my voice sounds a little crazy it's because my nose is completely acting weird on me and because um, my allergies are crazy right now. I don't like to take a lot of... Um, a lot of medications or allergy medications I just deal with it so that's why my voice sounds a little funny right now <laughs> it's just been crazy out here I guess because all these flowers are blooming people cutting the grass it's just oh it's been bugging me uh, quite a bit but I'm getting through it but I just wanted to thank you all so much for your kindness for checking up on me for um, waiting for my videos I really appreciate it you guys and I really do appreciate all of the support I hope everybody is doing amazing I wish you all lots of health and happiness and I will see you all very soon for another tutorial I will be doing a tutorial uh, using that Sephora palette so um, make sure you keep tuning in for that and uh, I will talk to you all very soon Take care. Bye.